Hello bee people, welcome back to another episode of Let's Talk About Bees. Today, the five things you need to know about bee propolis. Okay guys, so number one. If you remember from the last episode, we talked about that uh, bees collect honey and pollen from flowers. But bee propolis, as you see here, is collected from plants but not from flowers. So what is bee propolis? Bee propolis is a resin that uh, the bees collect from certain trees and uh, it's called bee glue as well because bees collect uh, the bee propolis to take back home and uh, use it as glue to um, glue uh, the combs or certain crevices that might be and uh, seal holes on the hive. So that is actually bee propolis. Number two. So what is the bee propolis composed of? Basically, it's, it is a resin, uh, but uh, if you do a chemical analysis of the bee propolis, you will find that it's composed of certain chemical uh, compounds called flavonoids. And flavonoids is a big family of chemical compounds, and these chemical compounds have an antioxidant activity for the, uh, the human health. So that is very interesting. Number three. So actually all the propolis that bees collect are the same? Actually not, because there are many trees that secrete this propolis and depending on the region that the bees are, they can collect a wide variety of bee propolis. So the one you see here is called dark propolis and uh, it comes from a um, certain type of trees. But for example in Brazil uh, there's uh, basically uh, three types of bee propolis. One is the dark propolis that is kind of the common one around the world but uh, in a certain region in Brazil they produce a bee propolis called green propolis. That comes from a plant called uh, the scientific name is Baccaris dracunculifolia and um, they found, the Brazilian researchers found, that uh, these propolis have very interesting chemical compounds as we were talking earlier. There is also the red propolis. The red propolis comes from the mangrove and it was discovered kind of recently and it has uh, certain antioxidant uh, properties that are very interesting as well, like the green propolis. But not even the green propolis or the red propolis are all the same. There's different qualities to it. Number four, can you eat propolis? Yes, you can. In the market, you can find basically three types of extracts. You can find the alcoholic extract, you can find the water-based extract, and also the powder extract. The alcoholic extract and the water-based extract, you can find it in liquid form. Those extracts, you can take them directly or you can mix them with a beverage. The powder extract, you can find it on capsules and you just take them as you will take any other capsule. Number five. So what are the health benefits of consuming bee propolis? So as I mentioned before, uh, the main components of bee propolis are antioxidants. But uh, as bees use it on their hives, they have uh, antibiotic properties as well. So if you use it on a regular basis, it can act as a natural antibiotic and antioxidant. So uh, it has a wide arrangement of health benefits that stem from the uh, antioxidant properties mainly. Okay guys, so those were the five things you need to know about bee propolis. If you have further questions or comments, don't forget to put it on the comment section below and uh, don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, hit the thumbs up and I'll see you on the next video.